What is going on you lot? Midi here. Guys, I wanted to discuss a little bit about the Warlords. So, as you know with Necromancer, Evil Ash got that buff. He can attack quicker. You know, it's no longer an issue to pull out your boss and just feel like they're really slow and actually get punished by this. They've done the exact same thing with Henrietta. So, she's going to be able to attack quicker. You're going to be able to finish your heavy or light attack combo a lot quicker. And I did think it was needed on Warlords and Necro. You got to understand... You should never feel punished to put out your boss. Think about Plaguebringer. As soon as I hit 10 with her, boom, you see me pull her out and then, you know, just going absolutely crazy with her. Whereas every time I pulled out Evil Ash or Henrietta, unless it was the fart build, I'd be like, hmm, okay, I'm about to get wrecked, you know? I did want to say, apart from the skill points with the prestige system, I feel like Warlord has the worst prestige unlocks. I mean, look at really bad influence. Enhances their damage by 5% extra. You know, their maximum health goes up by 15%. But look at the Prestige 5. So an extra 5% on damage, another 5% maximum health. They have attack frequency. Don't even go up. So what's the point? Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. But this is my build currently. It is mainly just buffing up Henry out a little bit. Obviously, we look. We need maximum health on her. We need maximum damage. I did have to take points out of my elite units, though. That's the only problem. So if you're going for more of a boss build, then you've got to make a sacrifice somewhere. Maybe you could take points off of possession extension, but I love keeping this on because it reduces the infernal energy required to maintain a unit. You guys know, Warlords at the start of the game, you possess a unit don't even matter if you've got like 150 infernal energy it's gone it's completed that's the build more or less i wanted to see how good is henrietta now hopefully we get a good game out of this one as always make sure you guys smash like on the video appreciate the support as always i'm still on that prestige grind as well man it's crazy because i'm playing two games at the minute i'm playing the new call of duty and i'm playing this at the same time so i'm juggling between the two at the minute but let's go into a game my right lads let's do it warlord and henrietta buff claim this world as i've got the misty own. grove map already the RNG's favoring the survivors. There ain't no problem. Ow. Who are they going to the be? I actually have no idea. So, who are they actually rolling with? They've got a Hunter Ash, they've got a Warrior them. Ash, they've got a Henry, and they've got a Pablo. This is a really good squad. If they're going for the Pablo Rush strategy. If they do, then I could be in big trouble. So, I'm definitely putting a point into my Demon Vision, especially on this map, and especially because they've got Pablo. You're going to be able to see the aura of the car a little bit easier. If you catch him going in a car, might be in luck. We've got dark ones over here as well. Result, okay. I'm a little bit scared, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. They've got a really good squad synergy, and I'm a bit scared about the Pablo Russian. So I'm just trying to... Yeah, we go. That's the first map we start with. Oh, lordy. Oh, lordy. In the future, we would okay. prefer that you mutilate them. Try not to panic too much. Let's just try it. Free as quick as we can. And go on a search room. Nice. Three. Let's go. My guess was that they might be up here. Maybe. Possibly. You never actually know with this game. So, is that there? See, sometimes the rush strategy, it, it works. Sometimes it don't work. Got to remember, if they're rushing things, then they're not going to have as many supplies for the later game. So you can always come back and, uh, you know, get somewhere. So, just keep on the move here. Check every area we can. If you really are struggling on this map to find them, you just got to try and make levels as quick as you can. That's trap in. That's the you know the whole shebang. Let's level it out. Let's see how quick they can do this though. There's another reason why I hate the map. Why I hate the map. It's good when you play survivors though, and you get this. It's kind of like oh, okay, cool. We're second. The humans have discovered Could be another really piece of the map. Here. Let's see. Have you lost your appetite for slaughter? Okay, what I'm gonna do now? I'm gonna try and make my way to the point because I don't think I'm gonna find them early. I think I'm actually going to get a nice little early advantage on me. So let's see what we can do. Try and get to the pages or something. Oh, mate, this map. They're going to have such a good strat. Is it the Pablo Rush strategy being used on me? Possibly. I'd be so proud if it was, you know. I really would. Okay. If we can get over here. Get over to pages, trap this out. I'm gonna put some traps down. I'm gonna level out my traps actually, try and get them to free so the elite spawn off. Haven't maxed them out though, that's the only problem. Okay. From that's under it. your nose, Done it. the living have completed the map. Alright. Do better. So it's a little bit different, I guess. For them to get all the map pieces done. Question is What well, are they gonna be coming here? And I'm super underleveled as well. Le being level 5, that's really low. Right, Hemi's literally there. Don't know if he's AFK or not. If he is, I'm going to take full advantage of that. See what happens. Maybe trap this, actually, if they're coming up this way. 
Might walk into a few traps here. I'm definitely not walking into that. <laughs> it's like the most rad of his trap. Two weapons. Just some mobs down. Let's see, Let's see what we can do. What the damage was? Son of a, somebody shot me. Okay. Possession. Let's get one more point in my traps for the elites. Let's see what happens. No infernal energy though. Let's see. They've got a nice little start. For sure. I mean look, not even not even touch ten yet. A very, very good early start. I can. To try and get a couple traps down here. I could never get of not sure how many traps they're going to walk into now, though. I think they've not got that many pink Fs. That might be why they're just continuing to loot. Instead of just starting the point outright. And again, with Warlords. Cost so much money to put stuff down. I feel like Warlords, yeah. If you get caught with no points in anything, look, you're going to get wrecked a lot easier. Let's see what we can do. Let's go pin to pew. Yep. This is going to be the, the best early start for them ever. By the living. Let's see. Now would be a good time to end their lives. Let's go. Nice. Let's go with the damage then. Hey, yep, yeah, they've definitely got the damage here. Absolutely got that damage. Ain't nothing you're going to be able to do about that. The unit. So. Constant pressure though, you see this? Always got to be pressure on point. Your mob gets knocked out, it's not a problem. It's puke. So essentially they get one free point because I've not got my boss. That's kind of what's going to happen. Okay. Jump through. Oh, don't know how I missed with all that. Yes. Oh, yeah. Just getting them off point, you see, look. Waste some time getting them off point. There we go. A couple more tracks down. I mean, I would never leave point, you know, ever. Something like that. So, it's a pew. We've got the balance bar, I think. Yep. Drop units. There we go, there we go. Off the units. Get possession. That's what we can do. Oh, he's doing good. He's doing really good. Considering I'm not 10, but well, I am now. There we go. Let's get boss out for a bit. Mark gas out. Let's see what. Let's see if Henry has actually been buffed here. Ran into uh, just the damages here. Obviously, you might say it's a bit of a waste, but listen, I wasn't going to get her anyway. I wasn't going to get that much damage out. Let's go for slam. The AOE. Come on. Okay, they've done it. It's a really good job. That's that. You've got to remember, though, Warlord, even if you got a terrible start, still got a massive chance on book. Always. Always. So they have actually done an extremely good job there. I mean, the map, Pablo, oh, it, it's nothing better than getting Pablo on this map, for sure. And if you're going up against more of a class like Warlord and Necro, yeah, it's a bit painful. But you got to remember, you just have to chill yourself out a little bit and realise it's all to play for for Dark Ones or Book Stage, you know? Always. I'm going to throw these elites down. I'm going to try and find them again. Oh, I don't know if they're going to go for the next map piece. I mean, I didn't even waste that many colas there. So, see what they're doing. Kind of what I've got to do here is delay as much time as I can before they get to the next point. That means removing any cars around the map, you know, anything. We shall break their ranks. No, no, no. That was a waste. That was so bad. Okay. What have we got? Getting up on my elites. I want to make them a little bit tankier. Using two cars. Sometimes it's hit and miss because even if I take one of these cars, the other one has to come back. I mean, they could just start next point, I think. They've already got the advantage there. So annoying. <laughs> so annoying. I couldn't even take the car in time. It's so painful, man, sometimes. It is what it is. 
So they can literally just go to the next point, start it. Um, yeah, I'm just thinking about if I should just try and try and zone out the Pablo for a little bit. Let's see what happens. We've got a really good chance here. That's the next point started. Let's go. The humans have located the Kandarian dagger. Get a jump scare. Stop them before they take it. Mm, more mobs down. I guess there's only Ash out for a bit. You're gonna notice now. Look, the possession damage is so much more. Another possession out. Okay, nice. It's a puke. Okay. Units again. Let's get another unit. Our boss is on about a 30 second cooldown here. Should be alright. Sick. Not gonna touch the hunter. Oh no, he's just gonna be able to dodge all of this. It's a few. Alright, there we go. So thirsty. Nice, popped out. All about trying to get these hits out, look. All about getting the mates out if you can. Okay, come on, boss. Okay, got that. Yeah, we've got boss. Let's go. Comes boss boys. So the attack speed does feel quite good, I'd say. It's a little bit quicker. While the gas is up, you want to take full advantage of this. Henry's not got his um trying to get Coda in there, like, trying to interrupt it. Yeah, the, I'd say so. The attack speed does feel really good. I'm gonna drop this. I need to get anywhere else with her. Get Elite out as well. There we go. I'm to be a bit of damage here with him. Come on. Let's try and get him. Come on! Doing damage though, doing definitely doing damage. That's another Kodar. Trying to just get the colas out. If he can waste colas, I think we're right. right they've got this point. Okay, very good. That's that, that's that. That's almost my basics match. So they're here. Okay, I've definitely got to delay a car here if I can. See what I mean? Oh, the Warlords, how their damage creeps up. Even though I had the worst start in this game ever, I'm still level 21. The dark ones must not now fall. listen, I could trap this area out completely. It is a strat. But I want to try and delay as much time as I can here. I want to try and get their car, stop it off. Worst case scenario, I go for book here. Which I think, oh, I've got an alright chance. But that's the problem. Because I put more points into my boss uh, instead of my elites. They're not as tanky. I do rely on the elite sometimes to uh, do the most damage. That's what happens. Let's get shut down. Let's possess him for a sec. We can. He does have to change there. Okay. Another jump scare here. Right. Ash is the one who's going for the car at the minute. So this is what happens. We can. I mean, Hunter Ash, sorry. Might be waiting for him. Now, if Pablo goes out. Oh, we're going to waste that infernal energy. Okay. I need to try and get a little bit ahead of him here. Because I haven't got the infernal energy to get rid of the car. It's the only problem. Always well, an infernal energy issue. They might be looking for more colors, I think. See what happens. Oh. Back out. Shit. Try and get rid of that. Right. It's going alright at the minute. He's going alright. We're going to go to the next car. I've got a jump scare. Infernal energy, unfortunately, is low, but I can't put too many points into it. Need him elsewhere at the minute. Let's see what happens. Right, he's got one car. Are they going to split car yet? Let's see. All right, let's that. He's going dark ones. Always got to keep your eyes on dark ones. You don't want him starting. That's like the only opportunity you've got to do the most damage. He's there. It's only 100 meters away as well. Yeah, they're going to start it early, you see. What is he? I've got my eyes on it right now. Still no Infernal Energy, though, look. Look. So low. All of it's so low. She can't do anything. Gotta try and get a couple traps out. Normally works. Not nice. I'm going to put one point in that. Patchy up. Yeah. That'll be all right for now. Could have just trapped the area out, maybe. That would have probably been a better strat. Just feel like there's no infernal orbs. Look! 
Like nothing. Another reason why Warlord and Necro, I'm not a huge fan of playing them sometimes. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what happens. We are near. Let's see if they can take it out in time. Come on, boys. Let's go. Get that fucking damage out, boys. Get that damage out. Not bad. I just can't find orbs. Look, no orbs at all in this whole area. It's crazy. I'd rather than just start this, yeah, like this. Go off a bit like that. There we go. What we can do. I don't think they got colas. To be honest with you, I don't think they got any colas. I'm gonna drop this for a sec. Get some mobs down before I pull out boss. Come on, there we go. There we go. Now Henry is the lowest right now. All right, we had to kill Pablo. Come on. Whew. Yeah, the attack speed is definitely there. You can tell, man. With that. Come on, come on, come on. Look at that attack speed. Look at that attack speed. Woo. That attack speed ain't fucking about, boys. Lay that now. Hold fast, my friend. Summon your strength. Yeah, they're gonna try and rush that down, but without Pablo, they are kind of screwed. Somebody shot me. Rise and shine. Come on, come on. Got the body. Get the heavies in if we can. Nice. Start in the body for a sec. He's trying to rush it down. Where's Henry? Oh. Kill him. Oh, 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 oh. Nice. All low, all low. He's down. Resin. Oh, he's got the ult, of course. I mean, trust me, it was a lot slower than this. You know what I mean? We get resin. Ah, come on. Yes. Yes. That's it, boys. This is the comeback. Even with the worst start ever. Come on, come on, come on, come on. See what he's doing, trying to run over here. I mean, he's just trying to get me on book stage here. I'm gonna drop boss, fuck it. Come on, come on, come on. Go for the res. Oh, just got him up. Just. I'm gonna drop him, Pablo. Been a lot. Just trying to max out my infernal energy, really. <laughs> I mean, they could just go for the res here. Giving them the chance, if anything. There we go. See what we can do. I've dreamed of this um, right, the ult is out of the gas right now. They can't even do anything. Let's go for Ash. Make sure he's not getting this down. No. You think you can kill me? Come on, come on, come on. There we go. End of Oh, he did get the res, actually. He must have went out and guessed and got it. Wait, what? Maybe he did. Fucking hell. Come on. Alright. Use that. Look at this. All really low. Oh, Man, I'm going, for the, I'm going to go for the... Um, I'm definitely going to go for the damage play here. They're going to put me on book stage. And I'm just going to rush book. Fuck it. Let's go. Let's go. Look, Sage, it is, lads. See how they go with this. Oh. Into the next one. There we go. Look, it is, boys. Look, it is. You got to remember as well, because they're so low, they've literally got to watch out for my um, for my cleave damage, really. There we go. Let's get the elites. Not going to be doing as much damage, though, unfortunately, which is a little bit annoying. Hey, ain't too bothered. Oh. Next. Yeah. There we go. Into the heavy sort of book. Ready. I could probably kill him, but it's got to be book, mate. It's got to be book damage. Who can get down, though, mate? They've definitely increased their health with this shit. Look at this. And go, drop. Alright, our boss. We can use boss on this. See how we can get down. All heavies on book. 
They've literally all got to go from here. Ooh, this is going to be close. For sure, this is going to be close. Just need to get every heavy I can on this book. And this is why the attack speed's going to help. Enemies down. Hey, look. That's the cleave damage, look. Ooh, going down, mate. Ooh, going down. Ah, we got this, boys. We got this. Yep, nice. Oh, yeah, there's more, boys. Always more. Always more, lads. Boom. Oh. And that's book. Wow. I had definitely made mistakes there for sure. When they all went down on that dark one stage, I don't know where it was, but the infernal energy seems weird. Really weird. Goes to show you though, if I had more skill points into my elites than I did my boss. Yeah. Oh, God damn. See that early advantage? Still winnable, even on Humanity book stage always. And that's without points into the elite. Remember that. Pathetic.